Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. If you are like me, always looking for the best tools to streamline your tasks and boost productivity, then today's video is just for you. I'm exploring Asana, a powerful productivity tool gaining popularity amongst individuals, teams, and big companies worldwide. I know what you are thinking. Another productivity app? I get it. With so many options like Trello, Notion, and Monday.com, it can be hard to figure out which app is worth your time. But don't worry, I've done the digging for you. So let's start with the basics. Asana is a work management platform that helps you organize your tasks, projects, and team collaborations all in one place. Whether tracking your to-do list or managing a team project, Asana provides features catering to a range of needs. So let's talk about the benefits that make Asana stand out. First up, it's flexibility. Asana lets you create projects that fit your preferred style. A traditional to-do list, a Kanban board, or even a Gantt-style timeline for more complex projects. And here's the best part. You can switch between these views seamlessly. So if you love visual organization, you are in luck. Imagine seeing your team's tasks, deadlines, and dependencies all in one place. Asana lets you set up workflows and assign tasks with just a few clicks, keeping everyone on the same page. And with the automation features, Asana can handle repetitive tasks for you, saving tons of time. And on the top of it, the Asana mobile app. When you're on the go, you can still stay on top, checking updates, assigning tasks, and making quick notes. Let's talk more about integrations. Asana connects with over 100 tools, including Slack, Zoom, and Google Drive. This means no more toggling between apps. Everything is right there. So how does Asana stack up against the big players in the productivity space, like Trello and Monday.com? Well, each app has its own strength. Trello, for example, is great if you are into simple card-based task management. Its Kanban style is easy to use and visually satisfying, perfect for small projects or personal task tracking. However, it can feel limited when managing more significant, more complex projects that need timelines or task dependencies. If you prefer the Kanban style to simple to-do lists for task management, please let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. And now Monday.com is also a strong contender. It's versatile, offers various views, and has customizable dashboards which are great for visualizing project data. However, it's more focused on data and CRM style management, so it can feel overwhelming if you only need a task manager. Conversely, Asana strikes a nice balance between simplicity and advanced features, making it a better fit for most teams. Let's talk pricing quickly now. Asana has four main plans. First is the basic one, which is free and perfect for personal projects or small teams. Premium plan comes with a price tag of $10.99 per user per month, which adds timeline, advanced search, and more for teams. Business is for $24.99 per user per month with advanced features like portfolios and goals ideal for larger teams. And then we have the enterprise version, which has customized pricing with tailored features for large organizations. So my point is that there is a plan for everyone, whether you are a solo or part of a big team. So finally, Asana isn't just another productivity app. It's a powerful, flexible platform that adapts to your needs and can seriously upgrade your project management skills. If you have tried Asana or similar tools, let me know in the comments below and I'd love to hear what's worked for you and your favorite features. Thanks for watching once again. And if you're ready to dive deeper into the world of productivity, don't forget to subscribe and turn on your notifications. I'll catch you in the next video and until then, stay productive.